Early level, the easiest ones. Static quads. Begin by sitting on the floor with your affected knee straight. If you can't get your knee straight, then just straighten it as much as you can. Now, brace the knee down into the floor. Hold it in this position for at least five seconds, and then relax. Repeat this at least five times. Holding the position for longer and performing more repetitions will make the exercise harder. You should perform the exercise three to five times per day. Performing it more often will be more of a challenge for you. This is a very popular exercise. It can even be used after knee replacement surgery, so it's normally a good starting point. Single leg raise. Begin this exercise by lying on the floor, embracing your affected knee straight. Now, slowly raise the leg 12 inches or 30 centimeters off the floor. You should aim to take two seconds to lift the leg to this height. Hold your leg in this elevated position for at least five seconds. You may hold it for longer for more of a challenge. Now relax and repeat at least five times. You can make the exercise harder by performing more repetitions. Repeat the entire exercise three to five times per day, depending on the desired difficulty level. In a range quads, for this exercise, you should sit on the floor with a rolled up towel or a small ball under your affected knee. Now slowly lift your foot off the floor. Aim to take two seconds to lift it. Hold your foot in this position for at least five seconds. Hold it for longer if you want a harder exercise. Now relax and repeat this at least five times. You can perform the whole exercise three to five times each day. Remember that the more repetitions you do and the more times you perform the exercise, the harder it will be. Middle level, knee extension, sat no resistance. This exercise is normally performed sitting on a chair, but you may also sit on the edge of a bed. Now slowly raise the foot of the affected leg until the knee is straight. Try to spend two seconds raising the leg to this position. Hold your leg with the knee straight for at least five seconds. You may hold it for longer if you want a more difficult exercise. Now relax and repeat this at least five times. Aim to perform the exercise between three and five times each day. Performing more repetitions and doing the exercise more times each day will increase the difficulty. Knee bend, mini or partial squat. For this exercise, you'll need something stable to hold on to for support, such as a chair. Begin by standing up straight, holding on to the chair. Remember to keep your back straight at all times. Now, slowly bend your knees until you can't see your toes under them. You should aim to spend four seconds bending into this position. Once you've reached the position, you don't have to hold it for any length of time. Instead, you should now slowly extend your knees to straighten back up into your starting position. Try to spend two seconds doing this. Repeat this at least five times and perform the exercise three to five times per day. You can increase the difficulty by performing more repetitions and doing the exercise more times each day. Quarter wall holds. Begin by standing with your back flat against a wall. Now, slowly bend your knees until they're at approximately 45 degree angles. Reaching this position should take about four seconds, and you should hold it for as long as you're able to without feeling any pain. You can bend your knees less for an easier exercise or more to make it harder. This exercise is normally only performed once per exercise session. You should do it after any other exercises that you're performing. Depending on how long the position is held, the exercise may only be possible once each day in total. Advanced exercises, single knee bend. Begin by standing only on your affected leg. Make sure you keep your back straight at all times. Now, slowly bend the knee until your toes are no longer visible under it. Aim to spend about four seconds reaching this position. It's important to make sure that your knee stays over your toes and doesn't drift inwards or outwards. You don't have to hold this position for any length of time. 
Next, slowly extend your knee until you're standing back up in your starting position. You should spend two seconds straightening into this position, if you can. Repeat this at least five times. You can do it more times for a harder exercise. Aim to perform the exercise between three and five times per day, depending on the desired difficulty level. Knee extension with resistance. Begin this exercise by sitting on a chair. You'll need to use something on your ankle to provide added resistance. People often find that sandbags or exercise bands work well for this. With the added resistance in place, slowly raise your foot until your affected knee is straight. Aim to spend two seconds raising your foot into this position. Hold this for at least five seconds. You may hold it for longer for a harder exercise. Next, slowly to a count of four seconds. Relax your leg back into the starting position. Repeat this at least five times and perform the exercise three to five times each day. You can make the exercise harder by performing it more times or doing more repetitions. Parallel wall holds. Be aware that this is an advanced exercise. Begin by standing with your back flat against a wall. Now, slowly bend your knees until they're at 90 degree angles. You should never go lower than this during the exercise. Hold this position for as long as you are able to without feeling any pain. Some people can hold it for over five minutes. The exercise is normally only performed once per exercise session. You should save it until last if you are performing other exercises. Depending on how long you can hold the position, it may only be possible to complete the exercise once per day in total.